Hello everyone, this is a quick demo of the events calendar, uh, a calendar by Modern Tribe, and the events calendar shortcode, a way to list your events on a different page than the normal events calendar page. So let's get started by installing the calendar itself. And I'm gonna activate that. So you get this nice uh, welcome screen here. But for now, I'm just gonna head to settings. So by default, it's gonna show up under events. So if I open up a new tab and go to that page, you can see that it shows the calendar on slash events. So if I want to show that on a different page or rename it, I could rename that slug there, save it, and then refresh. But I'll leave it there for now. So let's add a couple events so it'll show up on that calendar. Set the time. Put in a venue. You can add an organizer if you have another website that they should be able to see as part of the event, you can put it there. And if you have a cost, you can also put that there. Also add a featured image to the event. You can also organize by categories. You could add some tags. And they give you some also other event options that you can use. So I'm just going to publish this. And now we can see on the calendar. There it is on the 15th. And you can view the event details, see the cost. You also have the option to view as a list. And you can see how that looks there. But what if you want to add your events to a different page? So we can show how that works by creating a new page. Call this about. I'll put some dummy text in there. And there we are. So we've got our new page. You can see it's down here. And I want to list the events that are coming up just underneath here. This is a big part of what this website's about is the upcoming events. So I want to show it in more spots. So if I head back and go to plugins, add new, search for the events calendar shortcode, install, activate that. And now it adds a little shortcode option underneath the events. And it gives you a bunch of options that you can do, but the basic shortcode is just to add ECS list events onto whatever post or page or blog post, wherever you want to put your list of events. So I'm going to go back to this page, edit it, go down to the bottom, add that short code, hit update. And now when I go back to that page, we can see that we've got a link to the event, the time, start and end, and it'll now list whatever events that we have under here. You can see how this works if we add, say, one more event. And now that that event's published, if I refresh the About page, we can see that it shows up underneath. So you can see that it lists the events, but it needs a little bit of formatting. It's got this bullet. Uh, it's very easy to do if you know a bit of CSS. But if you don't and you'd like a couple kind of nicer looking designs, there is a pro version. So if you head over to the short code, you can see kind of an example of what these uh, pro designs look like. There's a bunch of different options, but you can see it shows the costs nicely aligned. And there's also this compact view with the month and day and larger letters and the title of the event. Again, with some options, you can actually show the venue underneath and a couple other things. So if I click on one of these images, it'll take us over to the site where you can click get started now and grab those nicer designs. So there's a quick intro of how to use the events calendar and the events calendar shortcode together to show the events on your site.